everyone, welcome to yet another role play card session from Teachers Academy and this is Aishwarya and here with me I have Varsha. So for today's role play, we have chosen a situation where the situation says it's a home visit. And as per the scenario, so once we go through the scenario, we'll get to know that this is a home visit. Along with that, it is mentioned you have examined the patient. So it is a merged case in which we'll be having a home visit. Along with that, this is a just examined case. That is the role play card in the scenario and this is a routine home visit at the same time just examine case. So we have to analyze the situation by understanding the setting, scenario and the task. So let's begin our today's role play. During the time of conversation, how can I address the patient? So you may call the patient Peter. Thank you. Let's begin the role play. Okay. Well, I have completed the examination of Mr. Peter. Before proceeding further, could you please tell me your name once again for the communication purpose? Oh yeah, sure. So you can call me Varsha. Thank you, Varsha. So Varsha, let me tell you, I have completed the examination of your husband. And I just want to know how you're managing the situation since my last visit. Well, nurse, so I've recently had to go back to my work. So I'm balancing being a worker and also a carer and it's pretty difficult for me. So what I did is I kept a fridge and a microwave in the bedroom and leaves out the meal every day. But I'm really worried. I don't know whether this is enough. Well, Varsha, I can totally understand your situation at this moment. But let me assure you, you are doing your work in a very good manner. You are caring for your husband. At the same time, you're working full time. That is completely a difficult task, but still you are managing it in the best way. But as per the assessment of your husband, let me tell you, your husband requires constant monitoring and round-the-clock assistance. So will that be convenient for you at this moment? Yes, nurse, I can completely understand the situation. I knew that eventually my spouse would require a round-the-clock support, but I don't know what should I do for this thing. Yes, uh, your concerns are very much reasonable, but you don't need to worry. I can give you the suggestions for the same. Either you can arrange a full-time carer for your husband or get an admission in a nearby nursing home. If both the options are not convenient for you, then let me tell you, you have to leave your work. Will that be okay for you, Varsha? Oh, well, so nurse, I'm so sorry to say that there is no way I can give up my job because, uh, you know, uh, I need money to pay the rent. Moreover, uh, just like you gave a suggestion, the nursing home, it's a good one. But I don't know whether my husband will be agreeing to the same. Well, Varsha, I can understand the emotion of your husband and I respect that. But let me tell you, nursing home will be the best option that is available for your husband care at this moment. Because if you're getting an admission in a nursing home, they will be providing your husband with the high level of round-the-clock care by the experienced staff. Well, Varsha, do you have any other concerns now? Yes, nurse. Could you please guide me to find a best nursing home for my husband? Yes, definitely. I can advise you with choosing the right nursing home for your husband. For that, please share the list of requirements for your husband care and the preferred visiting time as well. And if you want to, I can arrange a conversation with the nursing home staff or the concerned residents for your confirmation purpose. Will that be okay for you? Yes, nurse. So, Varsha, is there anything else bothering you at this moment? Well, nurse, could you please give me some suggestions for the nursing home so that I can discuss the same with my husband? Yes, definitely. I can share the contact numbers of nearby nursing home, which you can discuss with your husband. Will that be okay? Yes. So, do you have any other questions for me? No, nurse. Okay, on that note, as per our discussion, you have decided to send your husband to a nearby nursing home because he requires the round-the-clock assistance and care. So, Shall we proceed with that? Yeah, sure, nurse. All right, Miss Varsha. Then on that note, let's wind up our conversation and we'll be meeting very soon. <laughs> 